Tonight, the varsity team is rolling. How would they return after a loss during Christmas break? Their first game since that loss, their rebound coming up. The girls team played a tough game versus Northampton yesterday. What were their results? Cross country sophomore and freshman meet moved up till tomorrow. And wrestling will place Chelmsford in the national sports. Team USA is playing in the World Juniors gold medal game. From Shepherd Hill Regional High School, this is Shepherd Hill Sports Zone with Cameron Simpson. Hello everyone and thank you for being with us on this Friday. Thanks for ending your week with us with Shepherd Hill Sports and we got so much to talk about when it comes to the world of Shepherd Hill Sports. Let's not waste any time. The Rams took on the 1-4 North Middlesex team yesterday night. A solid game for the boys who came out strong in the first quarter. They put up 16 points and then another 18 in the second, only, only letting up eight and then scoring 11 in the second quarter. At half, they led the game 34 to 19. They didn't stop in the third with another 17 points scored in the final frame. The Rams led 46 to 31. Heading into the final frame, the Rams led 46 to 31. In the fourth, 12 more points added to the Rams three-point total. They defeated North Middlesex 63-46. to It was Lucas Miglianico. I feel like we've been saying his name a lot. He scored 27 more points, shooting five three-pointers in the game. Lucas is a leader in points in Central Mass as of now. He's within the top five of all scorers in the area. Great accomplishment for him, and we hope he continues it up. By the way, he averages 24 points a game. Another person averaging really well is Zach Wenningberg. He collected eight free throws on his way to 20 points last night. Logan Daniels and Sean Tyrell both scored five. The next game is against the undefeated Millbury tomorrow at three. Well, the varsity girls played Northampton Wednesday night. They're undefeated, the Northampton team, and heading into the game, Shepherd Hill was expecting a tough one. They only put up two points in the first quarter and they let up 11. They only had five points that they scored in the second. And by halftime, Shepherd Hill had seven points in total. Northampton, 26. It didn't get much better for the Rams in the second, letting up 23 points in the second half and only scoring 22. They lost 49 to 29. It was Jaisy Santiago and Ashley Dickot who had 10 points each for the Rams. 10 of their 29. T tonight, the game versus North Middlesex, who is 1 in 5. The Rams look to rebound. It starts at 7 o'clock. They are on the road. Girls JV lost to Northampton 41 to 34. We did not hear anything about the boys' JV team. The cross country freshman sophomore race just got moved up to Saturday instead of the scheduled Sunday due to the winter weather pending that we've been keeping our eyes on it. We'll also keep our eyes on the boys race and the girls race to tell you what happens. The wrestling team is in Chelmsford this weekend uh, to take on some top 20 nationally ranked teams as well as some divisional teams. So it should be a tough meet for them. We'll see how they do in Chelmsford. Finally tonight in the national sports, the World Juniors is an annual tournament where some of hockey's youngest stars, drafted and drafted, undrafted, get to represent their country. You might remember Patra and others from the Bruins getting in it and other NHLers. Some are expected to be drafted, but the tournament has concluded as of the time this video comes out. But in the time of recording, it is 4-2 Team USA in the gold medal game versus Sweden. This will be a historic win for them. Canada has dominated the World Juniors as of recent, and this is a big game if Team USA can take out the really heavy favored Sweden team. So we're watching Team USA. Let's hope they get the win. As of now, we don't know. They're winning. I'm watching the game while doing this, so we'll see if they get it. And best of luck to the girls tonight. Hopefully they can get that win. Best of luck to the boys tomorrow. And of course, you know it. We'll be wrapping it up again on Monday with everything that goes down. Thanks for watching. I'm Cameron Simpson. You guys, hopefully you enjoyed it. Have a great weekend and good night. Thanks for watching Shepherd Hill Sports Zone, the only place for Ram Sports News.